out here on the Loop Creek property. And uh, we came across this area that they've been doing some road repairs on. They dug out the ditches here and we're noticing quite a bit of oxidation in the soils and on some of the samples here. I got out and had a quick look and I found this right here. You got sphalerite and pyrite. So we're just going to poke around here. We're going to try and dig off some of this bedrock and see if we can find something in place in the bedrock. And we'll take a look at some of these samples just in this area here. We have this zone of disseminated pyrite from here all the way to where J2 is so far, about 10 meters wide. There's a couple areas I've noticed where you have this right here, and this is actually semi-massive and massive sphalerite. This is what your typical rock surrounding that looks like with disseminated pyrite. Show you a few of the samples I broke off from here. Looks like uh, there's some quartz in here where you're massive sulfides are the area that we found that's mineralized with the sphalerite is about a 40 centimeter wide area so we just found two areas here where you have sphalerite mineralization. One is right there, and the other one is up there. A little bit smaller area. We took a few samples over this area, bagged and tagged them, and we're good to go to the next place.